Happening right now, Sac Republic FC's fans are gearing up for what will be the club's biggest match ever. Republic FC is competing in the semifinals of the country's most prestigious soccer tournament. But what exactly is at stake in this U.S. Open Cup? CBS 13's Andrew Hobner is getting answers live from Heart Health Park for us tonight. Hey, Andrew. Hey guys, and you know, look, it's a pretty fair question, right? The concept of an open tournament, it's known to fans in sports worldwide, but we really don't have anything like it in the United States. So what is the closest thing you could compare the U.S. Open Cup and this Sac Republic run to? Well, we went and got the answers. Sac Republic is on the edge of making history. Looking to be the first lower division club since 2008 to make a U.S. Open Cup final. We can't wait 11,569 in the building. Uh, it's going to be unbelievable. But what does this all mean? Well, let's start with the basic analogy. It is the March Madness of soccer, right? Except for instead of 64 teams or 68 teams, right? There's 105. If an MLS club is a Duke or a Kentucky, think of Sacramento as a Sacramento state. So this, in quote unquote, would be the final four. Republic are your Cinderella, and area establishments are preparing themselves. We're expecting a full house tonight. It's sold out game. Heart Health Park sold out almost immediately. Honestly, our fans deserve this. They've been through a lot, and they deserve to to celebrate a little bit. We're excited to be here at this match in the, in the you know final four of the U.S. Open Cup. But uh, you know we're ready to go with bigger dreams in mind. If you win this game, you go to the Open Cup final. If you win the final, you make what's called the Champions League, which is the best clubs from the United States, Mexico, and the rest of Central America. Win that, and you're at the Club World Cup. But one step at a time. We're really just focused on tonight, taking down Sporting Kansas City. We're excited for the incredible atmosphere that's going to be happening, um, and excited for our fans to come out and experience it. And we talked to people within the organization who basically said, yeah, this is, we're not putting cart before the horse. You know, one game at a time, we tried to bait them and say, well, what would it mean if you actually went on and won that thing? They said, nope, we're not thinking past tonight. It is all about tonight and a celebration of this fandom and this team here in this U.S. Open Cup semifinal. One thing they're telling everybody, get here early because it's going to be packed between the State Fair and this game. Pete's on Arden, Device Brewing on 14th. They're also having watch parties if you can't get in this evening. Yeah, you're trying to bait them, huh? You're trying to say, hey, it's going to be a big yeah, deal yeah. if you guys win. <laughs> One match yeah. at a time, Andrew. What it's going to be fun. It, yeah. yeah, no doubt. All right, Andrew, <laughs> we'll talk to you and Sarah Hodges, of course, throughout the night here as they cover that big night for us.